Hello everyone. This is our little video of getting off the shroppy and onto the Langoclin. Yeah, always like to get onto a new canal. Yeah. Always exciting. <laughs> and it this, starts at Hurlston. Yeah, this this particular um, video starts, yeah, starts at Hurlston Flight and ends at Whitchurch. Yeah. I think that was 13 miles and 19 locks, three lift bridges. Yeah. And adjacent the Hurlston locks, you've got Hurlston Reservoir which is, I think it holds about 85 million gallons and that's actually fed from the Langoclin Canal and you'll see a little bit of footage as we go past the, the feeder channel and the Langoclin is then in turn fed from the River Dee at <laughs> a town that I can't pronounce so I'm not, not going to try and pronounce but I'll, I'll, I'll put up what the town is. And the reservoir then in turn feeds Crewe and Nantwich with drinking water and also um, feeds the Shropshire Union Canal. And a big thank you to this week's new patrons. Yes, thank well, you so welcome much. Welcome aboard and thank you very, very much for your support. So we've just come through Bridge 97 on the Shropshire Union Canal and we're now at the junction and gonna go up Hurlston Locks onto the Langoclin. Right, Debbie's now opening the paddles at the front and what I do, I just keep a, keep an eye on the back of the boat, just keep my rear button up against the gate so that will ride up that plate, but just keeping an eye on it, make sure it doesn't get caught anywhere. Because um, we have taken our eye off the ball back on the Kennet and Avon and got it caught. So. Uh, Vigilance is always very important in these locks. Yeah, so because the canal is actually fed by the River Dee, um, it has a flow. Yeah, con constant flow on it. And yeah. we're, we're on, uh, obviously, July time. I'm assuming uh, come winter time, um, because it's fed by the River Dee, with the rainfall and that, there's, there is a lot more flow. A faster flow, yeah. yeah. And the, the, at the top of the any lock, you, you have a weir and um, you'll, you'll see why Deb's laughing in a minute and at the, the bottom of the lock, the entrance to the lock, you have the bywash where um, the excess water then traverses ooh, traverses, <laughs> traverses around the lock and um, some of these look really bad but you manage to nail them others look 
not too bad and they Don't knock you all over the place. So just as you think you've you've actually you've got it, bang, you're all over the place. But hey ho. Right, so we've done the Swanley locks this morning, lock one and two, and the Baddeley locks one, two and three. Didn't film much of them because you can uh, have a little bit of a lock overload, just keep filming going through the locks. Um, but I'll get a little bit of footage as we go along, and as soon as we find somewhere um, nice to moor, we'll moor up. Well, the, uh, the weir there, I've just got the boat pinned up against it, um, took my eye off the ball, my fault, went to um, open the uh, lower paddles to drain the lock for a boat that was coming up and the front of my boat just got sucked against the weir. You weren't going to go over the weir because you've still got two and a half feet of boat beneath it but tried to pull it off with the centre line, bow thruster, nothing, so I had to walk along, get the bow line, throw it to Debbie who's not too pleased with me. Um, so uh, we could pull it off with the help of the guy who Can I was helping up. <laughs> yeah, yeah, his fault, yeah. Oh, God, had he, look had he not been... We've got a tricky one here, electric swing bridge. Um, yeah, so we've got ABC boats at Wenbury Mill, and there's the lift bridge, and the the control box is just on the offside. If you do come here, you have to manually close the road barrier before the bridge will operate, as we found out. And there's all the angry drivers now going across the bridge. Always look at you and make you feel about as welcome as a fart in a lift. Right, now coming up to the third lift bridge of the day and this one um, is open. So I'm assuming this is left open and only lowered for vehicular access to what looks like a nursery. got to a um, place called Grindley Brook. Grindley Brook, yes, with uh, six locks there, yeah. three normal locks, and then the last three locks, obviously if you're going up, um, was a staircase yeah. lock. Now apparently there is a volunteer lock keeper on there from April to October, from 8.30 in the morning until 6.30 at night, but when we went through there wasn't. Now this is probably because the network wasn't fully, fully up 100%. Running. Yeah, no. yeah. I think um, day boats could cruise, um, the higher boats weren't out, and obviously mm. us, us liverboards could still cruise. Yeah. So the the actual um, staircase of three um, were very, very leaky. I mean, sort of scarily leaky. To, to the point where halfway through the navigation, you you have to open the top paddles to do some some topping up yeah um we just got through but the boat who followed us had Lesson. gone up in um gone up through the first lock into the second and then as he went to go from the second lock into the third he was just smashing against the sill um so it was a case of opening the paddles on the top lock yeah. to flood some more water into lock 
the top lock and the middle lock so he could raise up enough to then get in yeah and make it with my hand doing yeah, everything it's it and it, it it's just one of those things at the moment obviously that will they'll get it sorted yeah and they, this this this, this couple had never done it before and they, no. they got themselves in a, a little bit of a pickle but uh, got through in the end yeah Right, at Grinley Brook Locks, we just walked up to set the lock behind me and uh, the by wash on this one's looking a little bit fierce so this could be fun. Where are we Deborah? We are at Grindley Lock 6. We've got one more to go and then we've got a staircase of three. Three, yeah. yeah. And then uh, and we'll be in Whitchurch. Yeah. Here in this full lock with the door, sorry, with the gate open. Um, because up there, there's a chap now gonna descend that lock. So he'll leave those gates open and we'll pass each other in the middle of the pound. Well, weather took a turn for the worst. Can't complain though. It's not cold. Yeah, I don't know whether you can see the water rushing behind me, but obviously Deb's now uh, draining down the bottom lock on the uh, staircase of three so we'll be going up them and hopefully we do it all all okay And then when we left Grinley Brook, it was just a, a short 10 minute cruise round to Whitchurch yeah. where we moored up. Mm. Yeah, so. Um, our the Langoclan. Yeah, our first experience of the Langoclan. Everybody has said, oh, it's so beautiful. Um, you must go to the Langoclan now. We're only 13 miles in. Like I say, we've got to um, Whitchurch. And. It's no different at the moment than any other canal we've yeah. been. Yeah, and most of the other canals we've been on have been very scenic. Mm -hmm. You'll get your nondescript areas, and then you'll find those those beautiful little moorings. Yeah, and the Lang Goplin so far has been no different. No. So um, hopefully it will get better. Yeah, yeah, and we was pleasantly surprised with how um, quiet. Yeah, quiet has been. Yeah, and again we're still just coming out of this COVID lockdown, so. Yeah, and we have or were warned that that the this, Langoclin yeah, gets this time very of year, busy. It is the one of well, is the busiest canal yeah. on the network, and probably the narrowest and the shallowest, <laughs> yeah, and the most Welsh. So uh, <laughs> stay tuned. Yeah, and so far we have, I must admit, been spoiled for uh, more in places. Yeah, There's lots, plenty of places to moor. Yeah, lots of armco everywhere, and again, is this could be due to the fact that. There's not that many it's boats so out there. Busy, yeah. yeah. So, um, Watch this space for that one. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and I'd like to thank um, another patron that popped up there, yes. um, Stacy Fields. Yeah, thank you very, very much for your thank support, Thank you so much Stacey. for your support. Yeah. And I think that is about it for this week. I think week, it yeah. is, yeah. We've managed to get through uh, <laughs> without giggle fits. We're on, we're on tea this week. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Don't know why this, why this happened like this, but hey-ho, we shall put a stop to this. Yeah. So if you've enjoyed this little video, yeah, press the like button. If you haven't already subscribed, press the subscribe button. If you want future notifications of any other videos we upload, the bell icon. And keep the comments coming. Yeah, yeah love your comments. Yeah, any questions you want to ask us about yeah. specific places, 
along the Langoclin. If we haven't actually visited them yet, we will be visited and visiting them. So yeah. uh, put that in the comments below. Yeah, and, and we'll see you next week. Bye.